हेलो स्टूडेंट आई एम मयूर गोंडलिया एंड यू आर वॉचिंग स्कूल ऑफ फिजिक्स स्टूडेंट टुडे वी विल सॉल्व ए प्रॉब्लम ऑन हाफ रेंज फॉर योर सीरीज विथ पीरियड जीरो टू फाइव प्रॉब्लम ऑन हाफ रेंज सीरीज फॉर योर साइंस सीरीज एंड फॉर योर क्वेश्चन सीरीज आर द सीरीज फॉर इंटरवल जीरो टू फाइव इंस्टेड ऑफ माइनस फाइव टू फाइव सो दे आर नॉन एज हाफ रेंज सीरीज we will take a problem on such type of half range series the problem is find the cosine series for f of x equal to pi minus x in interval 0 less than x less than pi the fourier cosine series is f of x equal to 1 upon pi integral 0 to pi f of x dx plus 2 upon pi summation n equal to 1 to infinity into bracket integral 0 to pi f of x cos nx dx bracket over into cos nx in decomposed form it is also written as f of x equal to a0 by 2 plus summation n equal to 1 to infinity an cos nx where a0 equal to 2 upon pi integral 0 to pi fx dx and an equal to 2 upon pi integral 0 to pi f of x cos nx dx here we will take this second form of the series we will calculate a0 and an and then substitute their values in the main series for a0 a0 equal to 2 upon pi integral 0 to pi f of x dx for our function f of x equal to pi minus x and therefore a0 equal to 2 upon pi integral 0 to pi into pi minus x dx expanding it we have a0 equal to 2 upon pi into integral 0 to pi into pi dx minus 2 upon pi integral 0 to pi x dx this pi pi cancel therefore a0 equal to 2 into now integration of dx that is x limit 0 to pi minus 2 upon pi integration of x that is x square upon 2 limit 0 to pi now if we put the limit of integration then a0 equal to 2 into here pi minus 0 minus 2 upon pi into bracket here pi square minus 0 upon 2 so which is equal to 2 pi and minus here this 2 2 cancel and 1 pi cancel with this pi therefore a0 equal to 2 pi minus pi and that is equal to pi so this is the value of a0 now for an an equal to 2 upon pi integral 0 to pi f of x cos nx dx put fx equal to pi minus x therefore an equal to 2 upon pi into integral 0 to pi into this here for integration we apply the formula of integrating by parts that is integration of uv dx equal to uv1 minus u dash v2 if we compare this integral with this one then here u equal to pi minus x and v equal to cos nx so by applying this formula we can write an equal to 2 upon pi into bracket here u and u equal to pi minus x so we write here pi minus x into v1 that is integration of v and v equal to cos nx therefore we write here sin nx upon n limit 0 to pi minus u dash that is differentiation of pi minus x which is minus 1 so we write here minus 1 into v2 that is integration of v1 it means integration of sin nx upon n and therefore we write here minus cos nx upon n square with limit 0 to pi here now in this term if we put the value of limits then we obtain sin n pi and sin 
and which are zero. Therefore, this entire term becomes zero. And therefore, a n equal to 2 upon pi into bracket this minus minus plus. So, minus cos n x upon n square with limit 0 to pi. Now, putting the value of limits, we have a n equal to 2 upon pi into bracket minus cos n pi minus minus plus cos 0 upon n square, which is equal to 2 upon pi into bracket minus cos n pi plus 1 upon n square here cos 0 equal to 1. If n equal to e 1, then cos n pi equal to 1 and therefore, minus cos n pi plus 1 equal to 0 and therefore, a n equal to 0 for n e 1. If n odd, then cos n pi equal to minus 1, therefore, minus cos n pi plus 1 equal to 2 and therefore, a n equal to 4 upon pi n square for n odd. Substituting these values of a 0 and a n into the Fourier series f of x equal to a 0 by 2 plus summation n equal to 1 to infinity a n cos n x. Therefore, f x equal to 1 upon 2 into pi plus summation n equal to odd into 4 upon pi n square cos n x. Here we put n equal to odd because for n equal to a 1, a n equal to 0. So, we take this 4 upon pi outside the integration. Therefore, we get f of x equal to pi upon 2 plus 4 upon pi into summation n equal to odd cos n x upon n square. In expanding form, it is written as f of x equal to pi by 2 plus 4 upon pi into bracket. Here, we take n equal to 1, 3, 5, so on. Hence, we obtain the terms cos x plus cos 3 x upon 3 square plus cos 5 x upon 5 square plus so on. This is the required series of the function. In next video, we will solve another problem of half range Fourier series with period 0 to pi. Please write your suggestion in comment box, like and share this video and subscribe my YouTube channel. School of Physics. Thanks.